In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the following Blender problem. So the unsupported graphics card or driver OpenGL 4.3. Now as you can see, the error should look something like this. And if you're getting it, I'm going to show you how to get rid of it. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is make sure you are uh, running the version of Blender that you got from their official website, okay? And if that's the case, and you have downloaded uh, the software from their website, so this is their official website, okay? That may be causing the problem, okay? And I'm going to show you how to fix it. If you're getting this issue, there's quite a few options of what you could do, but as I look through the forums and through different YouTube videos, none of them really seem to work for some people. So I'm going to show you a way that worked for me, okay? Now, if I close this down, what I actually had to do is download Steam, which is an app where you can basically play different games, download them and install them. But Blender is also available inside Steam. Now, I'm going to show you over here. If I type in Blender, there we go. As you can see, it says it's a free game. So, I mean, it's not even a game, but yeah, you can use it up here and it works perfectly. Okay, so this fixed the issue for me when they tried to open up a Blender from desktop, so uh, via the downloaded version I downloaded from their official website, it doesn't work and I get the error. However, when I run Blender through Steam, it does work very well for me. Now, I'm going to show you how to download Steam, in case you don't know. So you want to go to Google and type in Steam, and then look for the website, which is st store.steampower.com, and it says Welcome to Steam, and you want to click on it. And then in here, you want to click Install Steam, this green button, and then you want to select your platform and click on install steam yet again for me it's windows and this will download the steam setup for you onto your computer you want to click on it put in your admin pin if it asks you to then you want to click next select your language click next and there we go in here you want to select the destination folder you can just leave this as it is or change it it doesn't really matter and then you want to press install and this will install steam for you automatically onto your computer and now once that's done you'll have to create an account and once you've created an account you'll be able to access steam okay and then what you want to do you'll see the steam store just like i do over here you want to go over here to search and type in blender and then as you can see it's over here you want to click on it and then you want to scroll down to where it says use Blender and it says it's free, of course. Now you want to click add to library and then you click OK. And then once that's added to library, you want to go up here to library, click on it. And here on left where it says games, uh, you want to check everything. OK, so you want to check software, tools and everything. Uh, and yeah, you'll be able to find the blender in here. So if you, of course, if the list is too big, you can just hide these tools over here and you'll see that. Uh, under software we've got blender you want to click on it and then you want to press install over here and then you want to select where you want it to install so the c drive is going to be good for me you can create a desktop shortcut and create a start menu shortcut and then you want to press install and you'll simply be able to run blender through steam so once that's installed on your computer simply want to come here and then press the big green play button that will appear over here and it will run a blender for you without the error 